Tanya here at Our Gabled Home where it's all about a simple, beautiful, healthy, and sustainable living. And today I wanna show you some closet organization that don't have anything to do with Marie Kondo. So my closet, we have a his and hers, is behind these curtains in our hallway. And you can also see that we have some things up here. I wanna tell you what these are. Um, at some point we installed a pull-up bar for uh, my son here in the hallway. And so we have the bar up there um, that's no longer there, but um, we still have these supports here. So just in case you're wondering what that is. Let me show you what my closet looks like and then we'll go through some quick ideas on how to organize it a little bit better. So let me show you. So here we are, you can see that there is a um, whole lot of different things going on color wise. And um, so the biggest issue is first of all, that I have hangers in different shapes and sizes. So some clothes are a little bit higher and some are a little bit lower. And then you can't really see what's hiding in between these two. So you can't really see what you have. And then the clothes you're not gonna see you have you're not gonna wear. Um, so there's a few things you can do to quickly change that. And one idea is to organize your clothes by the sort of hanger that you have. If you want to not invest any money, if you just want a quick fix and just make it a little bit more organized. So what you can do is like everything that's higher up, you can pull that out and organize it so that you can actually see what you have in your clothes. So let me do that. So that's already a little bit better. I don't know how much you can see that actually in the video, but um, at least I have most of the clothes, most of my shirts hanging on the same height. So I have a little bit better of an idea of what I actually have. What you can also do is um, have them organized by the same type of hanger because you already know that this hanger has this shape. So does this one and this one. So I, if I have them next to each other, these clothes will be really easy to see and I can just put them over here. So I can go through my closet like that and organize it that way. Now, my preferred method is one where you actually have only one type of hanger. And my favorite ones are the ones that actually have a little bit of a shape to them. Let me just pull that out here. They are wooden. You can hang some pants here. You can hang here some, um, some scarves. Um, the issue when you have something on top and something underneath is that you're not going to see what's underneath. So you're not going to wear it maybe. Um, but anyway, so they have a, actually a nice shape and um, I'll link some sources below. Ikea has a really easy five pack or whatever for really um, little money. You can get them at any store. So just get the kind of hangers that um, you like to see and, um, and then just organize them all by hanger. So let me show you what that looks like when that's done. I hope you can see that this already looks so much better. They're not all super identical, but um, you know, they're good wooden hangers. I don't like to throw anything out that's really good to use, but um, this is already so much better. But still, it really looks like um, there um, could be a better organization. So what now I'm gonna do is I'm gonna sort them by color. So let me show you what that looks like when it's done. So now that I can see that I have sorted my shirts here by color, you could have the colors that you wear mo most often in the middle and the colors that you don't wear so often, like the blacks and the deep reds, whatever that color is for you, you can have them all the way on the outside. And um, it's a really easy way to organize your closet, make it a little bit more usable, see what you have. 
and um, then you can still go ahead and um, take out your clothes, look at them and see if you like them or if you want to donate them um, or give them away. Um, so that's just really one quick way to do it. You don't have to spend a lot of money by just um, organizing your hangers in a way that you have similar hangers together, then you can still add your color sorting to it and if you want to spend a little bit of money um, you can get rid of your hangers that you get from the dry cleaners and the ones that are kind of like odd and don't really fit in and then get some really nice wooden hangers so i hope that you enjoyed this video i hope that you saw that it's really easy and simple this is what it, this is all about and if you enjoyed watching it please subscribe to my channel you can also go to my blog at ourgabledhome.com where i have more tips for you. Thank you so much for coming and watching me here organize my closets.